Don't forget to click the subscribe button, comment down below, like this video, and click the bell icon to be notified. Morning. We are in the middle of a winter storm here in Minnesota. Every school district around us is closed, just not ours. So I've just dropped off Victoria at school and my guess is in two hours they're gonna call and I'm gonna have to come back in a snowstorm. The roads are super icy. The wind is blowing people everywhere. People are acting dumb. It's the wind. The wind is so bad. So it snowed last night. Some areas got 10 inches, we did not. We got a, a dusting maybe maybe two inches and it's just so light and fluffy it's blowing everywhere like across the roads so it's getting um, icy because the cars are driving over it melting it and then it's freezing on the road so it's unpleasant if we slow down it's fine but people don't want to slow down uh, but it's supposed to snow all day today so it's not really the going into school that's the problem it's the coming out of school that's the problem in my gumble opinion my never to be gumble opinion this isn't the part I was worried about so she has also her play instructor yesterday email now this play is starting to chat me because they seem to think this is Hollywood or Broadway or whatever because she said even if the school closes we will not shut down practice okay that seems safe so even if the school had closed we would have had to bring her down here anyway <laughs> at like 2 o'clock we had to bring her down here awesome this school is messed up y'all so, I just dropped her off. I'm gonna go home and see what I'm gonna do. I have no idea what I'm gonna do today. I feel so unmotivated today. After yesterday, after um, this morning dealing with all this snow, I just, I was standing in the bathroom while I was getting ready thinking, what do I need to do today? And all I could think was, I don't wanna do anything. As a self-employed person, that's not a good day. <laughs> Yesterday made me, I, I got to the point of, what's the point? What's the point? What's the point of breaking my bag when nothing happens, right? So that's where I'm at. For those of you who think everything's sunshine and rainbows in Stacy land, she's got it all together. No. I mean, I always said to you guys, this channel, I would be real, and this is just real. This is the reality of what, you know, happens. This is, the, this is one of the down times. So, self-employment is like this. Sometimes the down can hit you so hard and it's been rough. You guys know, you've been there. You've been watching. It, it, just, it just hit me yesterday. That this is a lot of work. A lot of work for very little return and I get that that's what happens when you're starting a business dang y'all it just can't catch break I can't catch break so then I don't want to work for like 24 hours <laughs> and then I'm gonna be like in my brain I'll go all right you can't stop me. But today's my 24 hours of morning. So that's how I feel today. Because I'm in that 24 hour period of. Well, I'm going to have to kick myself in the butt at some point. But I'm still, I'm still in my morning period. Oh, my daughter's texting me. Please, what? I want my juice. I forgot your car. I am not turning around for juice, y'all. Unbelievable. You guys, I'm gonna block my own.
my daughter. I'm going to block my daughter's text messages. Because I'm in the valley and I can't deal with one more person being crappy to me. And I'm going to have a crappy kid. Oh my God. She's texting me again. Okay. I just texted her. Feel free to keep texting me, but I'm going to block your number now. Well, when it rains, it breaks a window. So I got home from dropping Victoria off to this. Yeah. So evidently the wind kicked up a stick or something happened and the window's broken. <sighs> no lie though, the text from my daughter, I'm going to pop up the text from my daughter because I know there's going to be some people like, could you just bring her her juice? The text, this, this is the text. Someone will be bringing me my juice before dinner. And that's why she got blocked. She's been texting me ever since saying, I'm going to quit this. I don't want to be in this. I don't want to be part of this. Someone woke up on the wrong side of the bed today. And it was me. <laughs> I'm not in the mood. <laughs> I don't know. Let me see if I can figure out what I'm going to do. Let's paint this up. Remember I picked this up? Doesn't that look... Look, it's terrible. Like, it's got this weird uh, crackle finish on. And then it kind of looks like this should have been gold. Or it's got little gold flakes. I don't know. It was $8. <laughs> I don't know. There's something weird happening here. It's just got a weird look about it. I think it's going to go blue and white. So what I think I'm going to do is put a base coat of blue down and then highlight it with white. Um, because, ew. I like nothing about this. So there you go. Come at me. I don't care. I know there's somebody who loved this. That's the thing is like everything you pick up at the thrift store or you see at the thrift store, you have to remember somebody loved this once. Loved it enough to go eight bucks. Yeah, let's get it. We'll hang it on the wall. <sighs> um, Easter is coming. So the religious people will be out at Picket. You know, like I said, they're the church ladies. They're the pearl clutching church ladies. Don't want to spend any money. Uh, let me get my paints together, and that's what we're going to do. I haven't cracked out duck egg in a while. Let's do duck egg, boo. It's a little thick in there. I'm sorry, it'll cover it first coat, hopefully. Ooh, what's wrong with my brush? Well, the brush is all stuff. I got to get a new brush. Hang on. Let's get all that paint off there. Ooh, pretty duck egg. Must have forgot to clean the clear coat off this brush. Oops. Yeah, we got a fluffy brush now. Oh, this is broken. Was it broken when I got it? Well, what the flaming hootie who? <sighs> Y'all, I also broke a Hager pottery vase when I got home today. That was going to junk bonanza. Turned around, knocked it right off the counter. Just bam. Broken, broken. I don't care. I've started painting. I'm going to paint. I don't think this was broken when I got it, but hey, you know, could have been. Right, so it's way late in the day and they finally called off all act after school activities so the kid came home at regular time my husband had to go get her he cussed at me all the way out the door guys all the way out the door because I woke him up but he told me he was going to go get her at the end of the day and if they cancel school I'll go get her so I woke him up because he promised 
I didn't have to do it again. And then he was mad because there wasn't enough snow for him, for me to have woken him up. I'm like, tough. Anyway, here it is. Because I went from Stacy Glazes nothing to Stacy Glazes everything, I put a dark glaze on it. And it's okay. I like it better than it was, but yeah. No, I don't. I mean, I shouldn't have glazed it. Maybe. I didn't like it with the white and the blue either. I think maybe I just don't like it. <laughs> that moment when you realize it's just ugly. <laughs> gonna fix that <laughs> there's only so much we can do i'm not a wizard this isn't a wand it's a paintbrush <laughs> i didn't get my acceptance letter from hogwarts this is just a paintbrush <laughs> I can't, can't make magic so I think it's just ugly. <laughs> I mean, I don't hate what's been done to it. But I do think it's ugly. So I think, I mean, I do think there's a lid for every pot. So it will still end up going into my picket booth. But it's not mine. I mean, I it's not my thing. <laughs> but I would pick something else. So anyway, I, that's it for me today because it's like way late in the day and I took my time making dinner and I made a full dinner for my family. She's been running so much with archery and play practice that we haven't had like a proper sit down dinner in a really long time. So I made chicken and sweet potatoes and peas and I baked biscuits. Y'all, I was, I, was I was a good mom today. <laughs> Even if I will bring her her juice, I was a good mom today. No lie. So I will see you guys tomorrow. Visit my blog, peonylanedesigns.com, for more tips, tricks, and inspiration. Thanks for watching, everyone. If you like this video, please give it a big thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe and click the bell icon so you'll be notified of new videos. I post every week DIY tutorials and, of course, more Junkin' videos.